back to my channel in today's video i'm going to show you how to achieve this protective style um this is called turbo i'm going to put turbo in the caption on how to do turbo this is how i do uh the little scarf little looks you know people you see some simple but this is like my favorite protective style it's just so simple cute and you can you know dress your outfit up or down maybe down but you can you know it's just something to do while you're not doing anything so if you are new here make sure you like comment subscribe and turn your post notifications so you can be notified with every video i post please make sure you subscribe to me like please like just make sure you subscribe to me i really do appreciate it i promise i do like y'all don't understand i talk about it all the time but yes make sure you subscribe and do all that jazz and everything so but if you are interested in seeing how I do the turbo, make sure you keep on watching. Okay, so starting off with old hair, literally old. Uh, show y'all how I look from the back. Period. But yeah, start off with this. So what you wanna do for this uh, protective style, you wanna get your hair as flat as possible. So what I do is corner roll my hair all the way to the back and then I put on the scarf so it looks like flat and neat and real cute. So I must, y'all just gonna have to watch me braid on a corner roll. Uh, this is not a tutorial on how to do it. I, I don't even know how to do it on other people. I don't know how to do it on myself. So I'm not gonna show you a tutorial so it's gonna be a speed through to it. So. Um, but yeah, so watch me corn roll my braids. Alexa, play Hot 96.3 from TuneIn. Hot 96.3 from TuneIn. Aww. Commercial, bro. Thought they was about to bang. But yeah, let's get started. Is everyone okay? Y'all, y'all be sleep on LMA. I don't care what nobody say. Um, it goes Janae. I'm gonna get Janae the top. Then LMA. LMA fire. Ladies, if you see you hear me singing out. Ooh, yeah. I was in Okay, so guys, I want to um, say um, I'm going to just put only this product in because I still have products from when I did my hair. So so today I will be using the Strength and Lotion Stylish Shampoo by Shea Moisture. Um, this is the only line I use from Shea Moisture. That's the only line that works for me. But the Shea Moisture Jamaican Black Castor Oil line, fire. So I'm just going to be a little using that. That's it, period. Then rubbing that through my hair. So my hair can be moisturized while it's in the braids. Make sure you get them in as well. And then brush this through. Like my hair is masked off. Might not look like it, but it is. Y'all, I these brushes are so good. I love this brush. You see how I just do y'all see that? Period. That's how you do it. Then I'm a braid now. And like y'all, my parts ain't gonna be perfect. It's literally gonna be under a scarf, so it does. This doesn't have to be perfect, I promise you. But yeah, you're definitely if you have shorter hair and you really can't like slick your hair back for real, like short and thick hair. Trust me, you really gonna have to like braid your hair to the back to try to get it as flat as possible. Cause my stuff, bro. I need some earrings, bro. So my new job, bro. They don't even um. 
can't wear no type of jewelry. And I, I'm not taking out my cartilage piercing though. I don't know what they thought this was. But yeah, since I took my earrings out, I don't know where they are. So I need to go get some more. It's fine though. They're like, for one pack, they're, I mean, for one earring, they're like six bucks. The ones I wear. But it's fine. I have to spend that money. But yeah, y'all see, it's not perfect at all. Like at all. But it, it's flat, so it's getting the job done. So, but yeah, so that's how I do my braids. Period. Yes, and that's how you do it. And I'm gonna do it all around. So y'all gonna see that as well. So let's get to it. You can see as I put it down right now, baby. I can put you on a fight. You know that I could like me and change the life for me. I got what you need. All right, y'all. Y'all get the y'all get the gist. So I'm gonna come back when my braids is all done and completed. So BRB. So I am done. Alexa, volume zero. Thanks. So I am done with my braids, guys. They look tra tragic, but it's fine. So. period all righty so now okay so you're gonna take your scarf i got this scarf from love culture i don't know if you got that in your stores but it ran out of business when i got this so i got this from love culture and then so i don't know where you could probably find these type of scarves online like on amazon so just look up like turban scarf something like that that's something i will look up but yeah, because I want to get some more with like patterns and stuff. Give you guys a look, honey. Excuse me. So, you're going to take this. Then you're going to put it over your head. Just like this. Because um, when you tie it in the back, it's going to be pulling back anyway. So, you kind of want some hanging over your face. So, then I'm going to turn around for y'all. I kind of got a squat. So, yeah, so, then you take these two. And then you want to tie it like this. You know how you tie your shoe? Tie it like this. Then I'm going to pull some of this back because it was all in my face. Then pull that back. You see? Pull it over my ears. And then you want to pull that back. Then what you want to do is bring everything to the middle and then just wrap it. Wrap, wrap on the other part of the uh, scarf. You see? Like that. Okay. Then what you want to do is take the other piece and wrap it around that piece.
Then what you want to do with the extra piece, you want to just tuck it under. Tuck everything underneath. And then, now you just adjust the front. Bring a little hair back. Like this. I'm gonna tuck the excess extra fabric under the end of this bun. And there you go, honey. And then so how I'll get my lace looking cute. You know, I get some curlies out on the sides. Just, you know, add some little spice to it. So, that's what I'm gonna do. Put some. Be gentle, okay? Just don't, okay? Don't just ah, rip it off, okay? Just take some out. Like that, like, that's good. Hmm. Curly already. So, I don't need to do none of that. I'm do the same thing to this side. Please don't pull out your hair, just pull out some pieces. Okay, so this one. So what I do kind of like, so they won't like fly up. I'm gonna show y'all what I do to my curlies on the side. So I'm gonna take this Eben 24 hours edge tamer and a little hard brush. Then I like to just put some right on the root. You see how I just lay down? Right on the root. Then I'm gonna just brush it down. So, you know, it can like just lay, you know? Period. That's all. That's it, that's all. But it kind of looks a little frizzy. So I'm gonna just put a little bit of product on it. So I'm gonna put it. Just take some of that hair lotion and put on it. Honey, honey, cute. So lastly, you wanna just do your edges and I'm taking that edge tamer again and an edge brush. So now what I'm gonna do is just put some on my edges. Yeah. I like to brush this back and then I'm going to swoop that. Swoop that. And swoop it a little bit. Nothing crazy. And then swoop that. Swoop that. And then that's it. that's how you do it so that is it so let me just show you guys a 360 honey so y'all i'm squatting squatting down back on that oh. y'all thanks to the girls girl so this is a close-up and then here's the back and then the other side and that's it. It's a protective style, so something you can do. Um, this is what I usually do if I don't wanna do on my hair. Uh, tomorrow I go to work, so I don't wanna be feeling my hair when I wake up, so I usually just do a turbo. I call this turbo, so if y'all hear me say turbo, this is what I'm talking about, I call it turbo. So comment down below on some more video ideas. I'm always gonna ask that. I always comment down below more video ideas. Also tell me what you guys think about um, my turban look, um, I think this is so cute, but you know, it's whatever, but something simple and cute, but comment down below and let me know what you guys think. Um, I appreciate everyone who's been supporting me and everything I really do on a road to 900. We're getting there. We're close 
And after that, 1K, honey. Bro, when I hit 1K, y'all not gonna tell me nothing. Like, I have to come harder, like, because that's, like, when, like, things start to change for the tube, you know, for my channel, whatever. Because, you know, I reached certain watch hours and all that stuff like that. So, I reached my watch hours uh, already. So, we just got to get our subscriber count up. So, after that, it's going to be a game changer. Like, I really got to go hard on YouTube. Like, it's, I have no choice at that point. So, um... So when I get monetized or whatever, I have no choice but to give y'all content. I really don't. So, but I'm not going to say I have no choice. I really want to give you guys content. That's the thing. Like, but I have no excuses anymore. I can't be slacking. For real. So, yeah. So thank you guys for watching my channel. And I'll talk to you guys in the next one. Beat for the stars.